It's January 7th, 2013. I'm Brian Bishop, broadcasting from the heart of darkness. This is 90 Seconds on the Verge, presented by Ford. CES 2013 has arrived. The Verge is here in Las Vegas to give you the latest news in a week-long carnival of gadgets and gear. You'll want to stay tuned to our CES hub to get all the latest news, interviews, and hands-on impressions. Come on, you know you want to. Samsung has a vision for the living room, and it floats. Today, the company announced a stunning 85-inch 4K television. The Ultra HD Beast has a unique industrial design with a display hanging inside a metal frame. It will be available for purchase in March. Our own Neelai Patel interviewed Samsung USA President Tim Baxter, who actually doesn't own a 4K television in his own home. Yet. NVIDIA's Project Shield could be a gaming dream machine. Last night, NVIDIA took CES by surprise with a handheld gaming console. The Android-powered portable uses the new Tegra 4 processor and can stream games directly from your PC. We spent some time with the device and liked the feel of the controls. Unfortunately, NVIDIA wasn't letting people actually play games on it just yet. Never deterred, never hindered, Windows Phone 8 is coming to Sprint. Devices from HTC and Samsung will be coming to the carrier this summer. The addition will put Windows Phone 8 on all four major carriers. Don't count Windows Phone out yet. It's scrappy. And that's all of today's top stories. Join us tomorrow for another day of 90 on 90 from the CES show floor. Trust me, you're going to want to see this.